so I did psychiatry for three years. I trained in psychiatry for three years. And there is no sub-specialization in psychiatry in India. So that's why I came over to UK to do more training. And um, I came to Liverpool and I felt at home. So I've, I've stayed there ever since. I think we are working in very difficult times, as we all know. Uh, there's a lot of workforce issues. There's quite a lot of uh, clinical pressures. Um, so peer support is a key thing. Uh, it works for everybody, whether it's service users, whether it's um, people accessing a service, or whether it's clinicians or managers. Um, I think mentoring is a key part of that. So peer support can go a certain uh, distance, but mentoring goes all the way. I have a mentor, so I accessed my mentor through the Leadership Academy. Um, so I asked for somebody who doesn't practice in my field. So he's a GP from Manchester. So it gives a different perspective and uh, it's networking as well. So apart from mentor, I have a coach as well. So she worked with me on communication. So again, I asked for a female coach to give a different perspective. So recently, um, I've started doing DJing uh, for internet-based radio. So that's something completely new. That's something I've always wanted to do, but never got the courage to uh, like express my creativity. I think it's opened something new for me. So I work in a clinical team called Forensic Personality Disorder and Autism Spectrum Disorder Assessment and Liaison Team. That's quite a mouthful. So we uh, do assessments for people with complex needs, um, especially if they need secure services. And then we uh, provide them access to either inpatient-based services or prison-based services and uh, community-based services.